This is the first annual SEC machining competition. We brought four SEC teams in here to compete in order to machine the SEC logo. My name's Tony Schmitz. I'm a professor at the University of Tennessee, Knoxville. So the Southeastern Conference is all about competition. Athletics is what we usually think of. In this case, I wanted to extend that to be in manufacturing, and so a competitive environment, but friendly, um, was a natural way to do that. So we have four teams participating in this inaugural event, University of Tennessee, Knoxville, Auburn University, Mississippi State University, and Texas A&M University. Right, so right now we're getting everything set up for the competition. We're about to practice using the face mill to uh, cut off the top edge to make it a flat 90 degree surface. We want to make sure we go through those proper safety protocols. So we elected to take the Southeastern Conference logo, make it really big, and then separate it into four quadrants. Each one of the four teams then received the drawing for one of those quadrants, and that was the part that they needed to machine for the competition, which in showing our, our, our competitive but friendly nature, we then assemble into one logo. Manufacturing is everywhere. You can't make one thing without the ability to manufacture it. And so that's important to us because from a national security perspective, we need people to make our weapon systems, to make our high-end software systems. For decades, our universities have been focused on research at the expense of applied manufacturing focus. And these competitions are one meant to inspire the next generation of engineers to come into manufacturing. Every one of these young men and women that stepped into this arena today are winners. And they're courageous for being the first to participate in this competition. This competition I think is very valuable because you're actually getting people involved and engaged. And I think that the more that people get involved early, uh, the greater we can become as a uh, manufacturing powerhouse. Initially, I want to connect the SEC schools into a manufacturing consortium where it becomes a top uh, research topic for that conference, and then I want to spread it to the Power Five and beyond. We anticipate that the students that compete today and the students that we'll touch through programs like this will be reinvigorating manufacturing in the U.S. as they become the thought leaders and the company owners and the engineers that press us forward. Our funding primarily comes from the Department of Defense. We're addressing that whole ecosystem of workforce development. And that's what this, this program today is targeting. Machine operators are important, clearly, but I mean more than that. I mean machine designers. I mean NC programmers. I mean software developers. I mean the entrepreneurs who are going to start new companies. In the end, the four parts go together and they make the SEC logo. And this reflects the fact that we're all, at the end of this, on the same team. We've all got the same objective and we're looking at this supply chain issue. So first of all, I'm going to start by thanking the people that need to be thanked. Department of Defense and IBES for the funding that brought this all together in the first place. But really why we're here today is the students. Um, I'm so grateful for the time that you spent, the patience that you showed as things evolved as we went along. I hope at the end of the day, you had a good learning experience, you met some people, um, and you expanded your horizons a little bit. So number one uh, thanks is to the students who showed up here, thank you. And finally, we had 20 booth hosts that were out there. I'm gonna miss somebody if I try to name them. Um, so I just thank all the companies that showed up, shared what they do. We're here to recruit. You all heard it. Everybody needs to get a job out of this day. Um, and so thank you all for coming. Thank you. Well, first off, did you have fun? Yes. yes. There you go. And it, at the end of the day, in less than 24 hours, we got better. We got better as individuals. We got better as schools. And we got better as a country. Imagine what we can do next year. But this year, we got a crown champion. Football's a game of inches. Manufacturing is a game of micro inches. <laughs> right? 
<clears throat> and it was close. It was real close. And I, I wouldn't have placed any bets on this one in terms of who was going to win. But this year, in the inaugural SEC Manufacturing Championship competition, the winner is Tennessee. Woo!